Hello everyone, welcome once again to my page. My name is Sam from Film Editing Plus and today I'm going to be showing you how to attach a text to a moving object easily in DaVinci 18. So there are different ways in which we can do this but I'm going to show you a very fast easy way which you can do this in DaVinci. So we open DaVinci. I've got a um, couple of footage here which I got from at least an ad grid. That's where I get my footage and audio for my um, editing purpose so we've got here um, when I play it you can see it's just a young lady in a train a Chinese looking lady in a train and just holding a phone so we're gonna track a text to um, this phone so we're gonna do that in the fusion page so you first of all make sure you click this footage just to highlight it and then you go to fusion page so when it opens on fusion page automatically it gives you two nodes which is the media in and the media out node the first thing you're going to do here is make sure that the media in node is highlighted once it's highlighted then you click um, shift and your spacebar when you do that it opens the selection tool like you can see here and then you're going to type um, we're going to use the tracker so we type um, tracker and it gives you this so this is what we need tracker tra remember i'm using davinci 18. so you click add and automatically the tracker nodes it's connected to your media in and connected to the media out all right so since we've gotten that you can see um your tracker here on your clip so we need to move this tracker to the object which we want to track in DaVinci. So in order to move it, you see this little box here? This is what you're going to use to drag your tracker. And immediately you click it, it zooms in. So you bring it to the phone because we want to track our text on the phone. So you leave it there. Alright, so now your tracker is there. Very good. So once your tracker is there, you come to this part here where you have tracker, operation, option, setting. So before you start tracking, you come to operation and then in this column here you change it to match move right so once you've done that you come back to tracker and then adaptive mode you want to change this also to every frame now what this does it means that you're tracking every movement frame by frame you know for smooth tracking and then you come here to this which is your track forward so you click the track forward once you click it davinci resolve starts to track as you can see it's tracking every movement of the phone as the phone moves it's tracking it perfect tracking and then once it's done it gives you this um page here all you need to do is to click ok and then once you ok it that is good we've done our tracking and then we need to add our text so here you come here to the text icon you can either click it or you drag it once you drag it and bring it here, it automatically gives you a text node. But you need to connect your text node to your tracker. So you connect it through here, you drag it and you connect it to the green arrow here, and boom, that is it. So once you have your text node, then um, we need to type in something. So let's say a phone. We type in a phone text and uh, let's change the color you know so we bring uh um, let's just pick a neutral color here we bring it here you know just to match the look and feel so you do okay now that's fine so we've gotten that there if we decide to play this now you're gonna see what happens now you can see the text moving imitating the same movement like the phone you know which is very good, very good tracking. But now we want our text to be close to the phone, to be right on the phone. So you come here now and you move the text. So you can move it to wherever you want it to be, but we want it right next to our phone. So we can bring it here. Uh, let's reduce the size a little bit. So, okay, just to make it look a little bit cinematic and nice, pleasing to the eyes. So we bring it there. And then when you play this again, this is what you see. Very simple. You can see the text moving, imitating the movement of the phone. As easy as that. Okay. That's it. So I would also want to um, 
do another example i think here so we're going to repeat the same thing so i've got a footage here of a young lady jumping from the other side of the water to the other side so we're going to track her with a text so first of all you want to bring down your timeline and then you highlight it you come to fusion page automatically you already have your media in node and your media out node then you use your shift and your space bar you bring out that you search for your track tracker and you add it there automatically it connects to your media in and your media out and then you move your tracker here from here you move it to where you want to track so i want to track i want my tracker to be on ahead so i put it there on ahead and then um i have to make sure this starts from the beginning so i move it to ahead from the beginning very important you want to start from the beginning i put it there and then i change my adaptive mode to every frame and i come to operation i change it to match move and then I go back to tracker and I click track and you see what happens my tracker is on her every movement she does the tracker is on her from the beginning of the frame to the last frame of my footage and there it is it is done so I click OK now we can play back and see what we have done okay so you can see we managed to track her from the beginning to the end of the frame so now the next thing which we have to do now is to add the text node so you come here and you drag the text node here and you connect your text node to the tracker node once you do that you come here um, I think let's give a jump yeah jump so you can control the size of the text you can also change your text color if you want to okay so and once you do that you click on ok and then you can decide to move your text to above her or wherever you want your text to be but i want to put it above her here so and then once you do that then you can play back and see what you've got so this is what we have you can see perfect tracking perfect tracking so this is how you track your a moving object with a text when you play it from the edit page let's combine both of them and see what we've done with our tracker so you see this is very perfect and easy to do in davinci resolve so thank you very much for watching this tutorial please do not forget to subscribe to this page it helps us to make more video for you guys to watch out there and also the notification bell thank you very much